Hello Blazers, no fuck is that, how you guys doing today, welcome to a brand new video, so, uh, you guys probably, uh, you guys have probably heard, um, the latest news, uh, new neutrality has been repealed, um, our lives are over, basically. Commissioner Rosenworcel? I dissent. The chair votes aye, the item is adopted, with editorial privileges granted, as requested. Well, you guys' lives are over, because the majority of people who watch me are from the United States of America, and, uh, this law is probably going to affect only people who live in America, so... Fuck all y'all bitch asses. Yeah, I live in Russia. I don't care about neut neutrality. Okay, well, to be fair, you live in a you live in a far better country, so uh, touche. But no, being serious though, uh, even though neut neutrality is probably not going to affect me, I still care about the cause, and I think this is bullshit that it got repealed. Absolutely, it's really sad that internet freedom has been restricted in America as well, because in Russia that really happened in 2016. Basically, in Russia we had this bill that was passed by the statesman called uh, Irina Yeravaya. Which was about, uh, basically that the fucking KGB can spy on any of us. It's like legal now, they can actually spy on us and we can't do shit. And as well, uh, they can actually record our phone calls. Basically, we will ha as a result, we will have to pay like, uh, threefold or four more times for the same shit that we paid before, like internet and stuff like that. So yeah guys, as a Russian man, I lost all the hope. Uh, of ever having a free speech in this country, ever having a free society and a free internet, so it's really sad to see this being gone from America as well. But today, guys, specifically, I want to dive in with you guys and uh, check out uh, the legend that is Ajit Pai, who is, I mean, he's basically the new fucking Hitler. At this point, he's the devil. The anonymous doxed him or something like today on Twitter, and they're saying he's gonna pay, so I mean. It's not gonna be it's not gonna be great for him, uh, pretty much. And I don't condone doxing, by the way. It's not good. I'm not Kimsar. I don't condone doxing, but uh, I'm just saying maybe some justice is going to be served. Now today, guys, wanted to take a look at a couple of videos by Jit Pai, especially ones where he explains why net neutrality is actually bad, and you do not want it. So this video he released like yesterday is called uh, Seven Things You Can Still Do After Net Neutrality." It's a really great example of a uh, man who's so out of touch with internet memes and. Everything and internet culture trying to be hip and cool with the kids and that actually fucking hurts and it's an insult to everybody on the internet Hi, I'm Ajit Pai. Now before we get into this guys, the first shot of this video is already making me wanna die I mean yeah guys, uh, fidget spinner, isn't that- isn't that what, what's hip with the kids right now? Uh, it's not like the trend has died like fucking seven months ago or something. Yeah, let me just put a fidget spinner in this video so I seem a bit more likable to the kids out there. This is not how it fucking works, Ajit Pai. We still think you're the fucking Hitler, okay? I'm sorry. I'm Ajit Pai. I'm the chairman of the FCC. You suck, you suck. Recently, there's been quite a bit of conversation about my plan to restore internet freedom. <laughs> Is it taking the fucking piss? How exactly are you restoring internet freedom, my man? It's like if you put a guy in jail for 25 years and you're saying you're restoring his freedom. It makes no fucking sense whatsoever, Jeet Pai. Get- stop eating curry or whatever you're doing out there. Get with the times, doc. You, you're fucking insane. Here are just a few of the things you'll still be able to do on the internet. After okay. these Obama-era regulations are repealed. You can still gram your food. Quality. Alright, real selfie or just so as you guys, you already get what's happening in this video, Ajit Pai is basically trying to be cute and trying to be relatable by uh, saying he's trying to convince us all that he's an actual human being, because let's be fair, Ajit Pai is fucking deranged. Only a sociopath, maniac, psycho killer would try to repeal new neutrality, okay? This is, what, this is what this guy is, okay? You have to be a fucking sociopath lunatic. <laughs> this guy is basically doing the same shit as Mark Zuck. This guy is trying to convince us as much uh, as possible that he's an actual human. You know how Mark, Z Mark Zuckerberg always does this cringy shit like, Hey, here's a picture of me eating a sandwich. I also eat sandwiches, people. Uh, you, you can see, guys, I'm relatable. I'm just like you, fellow humans out there. It's not like I'm a billionaire who has literally lost the grasp of fucking reality. I'm trying to dehumanize humanity and make them all suck my pee-pee for Facebook... Uh, for Facebook likes. Sorry, I got kind of carried away there, but I'm just saying, Ajit Pai is not human at this point. This man has no human feelings, he's an absolute android, and he's trying to convince us that he's human by being cute and saying how, oh, you can Instagram your food, right? Because that's what people do, isn't it? You take uh, pictures of your food on Instagram, isn't that what they, what people did in like 2000 fucking 10? Cute animals, like puppies. Yeah, cute animals, am I right, guys? He's human too! Look at him! He's human! You can still shop for all your Christmas presents online. Yes. Yes. Like bulk deal on Christmas. Christmas. 
That's that's what yes, humans do. Those eclipse glasses are so cheap. That's what that's what humans do, guys. That's what humans fucking do. They spin fidget spinners, dress up as Santa, and destroy the fucking internet. You can still binge watch your favorite shows. Oh, can I? Yeah, Jitpa, I don't think you really writes about that one. I don't think you really know what your own bill fucking does because uh, uh, if uh, certain providers start regulating Netflix and stuff like that and starts cutting down speed from Netflix, many people would in fact not be able to watch their favorite shows on Netflix and online. So you kind of fucking run there. Jesus Christ, the goal of this fucking guy, like he's just taking a piss at this point. I think I think he knows. He knows his bill is destroying humanity, but he's just too afraid to convince it. <laughs> Yeah, guys, people like Star Wars. You heard uh, the new Star Wars movies coming out recently. Don't drive me right into the ground. And do the Harlem And everything else you ever did on the internet. Like, everything. All of it. Yeah guys, Ajit Pai, uh, he really does spend a lot of time on the internet, he's hip with the culture, he's a geek, okay? He knows all the latest memes, like Harlem Shake, for example. When, when was that? Like, fucking 2012? Yeah guys, you can, uh, after net neutrality is repealed, you, get, you guys can do Harlem Shake memes. Isn't that what you did 24-7 on the internet, you fucking retards? Isn't that all the people on the internet do? This video is just an absolute insult to everybody who has at least one fucking brain cell and is able to understand that neutrality repealing is destroying the internet. Does he actually think that making a video like this is going to convince people that repealing neutrality is good? Or is he just taking a piss at this point? Because... I mean, this guy, this guy is literally Hitler. Even before this whole net neutrality thing was as vocal and as, you know, the problem didn't, uh, wasn't as huge as it is right now, nobody's really talking about it. Ajit Pai made this video called Ajit Pai Reads Mean Tweets. As you guys can see by the, uh, <laughs> by the like to dislike ratio. Uh, you know, nobody was really quite a fan of the video, to be fair. And it's once again one of those, uh, how do you do fellow kids, uh, I'm hip with the times and I'm human too type of videos. Hi, I'm Ajit Pai. I'm the chairman of the FCC. I really enjoyed the Meaning I'm fucking Hitler in the flesh. The internet. And I especially appreciate some of your tweets. Ajit Pai reminds me of Pinocchio. Except instead of his nose growing when he lies, his head starts bubbling. Hashtag Pai Bubblehead. Shreese, I find that really offensive. I always tell the truth. Yeah, you guys, as you can see here, it does have human emotions. This is how humans act. I am not a programmed android destined to destroy humanity. Ajit Pai, Go back to Africa, where you came from. <laughs> do you even English, bro? Yeah, do you even live, bro? Do you even live, bro? Troll face. <laughs> Magusta. Over 9,000. Much while, lol, dodge. I, I, I'm hip with the memes, guys. I'm fucking hilarious. Jeep Pai is another fascist who needs to be apprehended and to be put on trial for crimes against the people. The guillotines are coming. Guillotine! Yeah! Jeep Pai, why do you hate America? Why do I hate America? Why do I hate America? Skinny jeans, kale, the Raiders, people who say acronyms like Bay and claim to be woke. I mean, what more evidence do you need? Yeah, why do I hate America? Because of a jit pie. People who say do you even left bro in 2017, and people who do the harmless sh Harlem shake. It's almost 2018, guys. It's almost 20 fucking 18. Also, is he trying to say that uh, being against uh, repealing new neutrality is uh, being woke and edgy on Twitter? Uh, my ass is on fire right now. I'm fucking triggered. Like, I knew Ajit Pai was kind of the new Hitler, but uh, actually sitting down watching videos of him right now. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm fucking amazed. Ajit Pai has an insanely punchable face. The fact that he's not getting decked in the mouth every day <laughs> shows there's no justice in the world. I think he does get decked in the mouth every fucking day because he kind of sucks pee pee right now. <laughs> he does get decked in the mouth pretty hot. I bet a cheap pie eats mayo sandwiches. That is fake news, man. It's like just trying to be funny when there's nothing to be having fun of. It's fucking abysmal. I mean, it's it's kind of like the same as my channel. Ajit Pai, just give up, man. If you would, if you want to be a comedian, then do comedy. Don't try to destroy the fucking internet. We good? Okay. Thanks, guys. Right. You wanna have my coffee? Ah, all right. <laughs>
<laughs> I hope there's some cyanide poison in that cup. I mean, Jesus Christ. So yeah, guys, what can we say as a result of today's video? A jeet pie is not human and is the next Hitler. Is it right to put a jeet pie on blast? Yes, I think it is, because he's kind of the face of the whole anti nuke neutrality, uh, you know, thing that's going on right now. And, I mean, technically, do I think that a jeet pie is the one behind all of this? No, uh, the Jews are. <laughs> and I'm just kidding, I'm not Alex Jones. I don't think the Jews are behind everything. They probably are, to be fair. Now, we're being serious, though. A jeet pie is probably just the talking head, and there's some... I mean, probably the companies, uh, the ISPs, the providers themselves are behind all this shit, and... Uh, I don't know. It's pretty depressing, guys. We just have to wait until shit unfolds, and maybe Newton Charlotte is still might end up being saved. But, yeah, guys, I think that is pretty much going to conclude for today's video. If you guys did enjoy it, please make sure to slap the motherfucking like button, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.